Yo, we're back again with another Top 5 Fails of the Week, and today we have so many people that are pretty much, you know, quitting 2K17, they're pretty much selling all their God Squads for like 1,000 MT, 2,000 MT, and even though the game is starting to die just a little bit, there's still people out there sniping, and unfortunately for this video, man, everybody ended up missing, you know, those cheap diamonds. There were so many great diamonds for like under 5,000, so without further ado, let's get right into it with the Top 5 Fails of the Week. And you know that it was a crazy week when the first player we show is the 97 overall KD. This guy right now is going for about like 200 or like 220,000 MT in the auction house. And this guy was fast enough to actually see it for 17,000 MT, man. But he ended up missing out on almost 180,000 MT. And even though this guy didn't end up missing it, man, we got to give this guy props though because it's so hard to see a diamond for like under 20,000 MT. That's a really good one. So don't let this snake bring you down, man. You'll eventually get a diamond for under 20,000 MT. And next up, we got the Snake's ex-teammate, Diamond Westbrook, for under 2,000 MT. And almost in every single video that I upload about sniping, I'm always letting you guys know that you need to be sniping those diamonds for, like, under 5,000 MT. You just gotta make sure that you understand that you're not gonna be getting every single snipe out there. And this guy could've made over 190,000 MT profit. But that right there is just how sniping is, man. He ended up missing Diamond Westbrook for 1,200 MT. And at the number 3 spot, we got the Big Diesel himself, man. 85,000 MT. Now, this card is still one of the most expensive cards in the game right now. I think he's going for about, like, over 400,000 MT in the auction house. And this card is so rare in the auction house, man. You can never find one for, you know, buy now, let alone one for 85,000 MT. And this guy could have walked away with over 300,000 MT made. But just like everybody else in this video, man, he walks away with a big fat L. And next up, we got one of the best cards in the game, man. The Diamond Tracy McGrady for 5,000 MT. And yes, you're looking at this correctly, man. 5,000 MT for the 97 T-Mac. This guy right now is still selling for over 400,000 MT in the auction house. And just looking at this picture, man, it's like 5,000 MT for a T-Mac. That's just insane. But people are starting to quit to get 17, so make sure that you guys are going out there and sniping those diamonds for under 5,000 MT. And at the number one spot, we got my boy Ruby. He ended up missing a Diamond Steph Curry for 100,000 MT. And this Steph Curry, man, one of the cheesiest cards in the game right now, man. He has Hall of Fame Deep Range Deadeye, Hall of Fame Limitless Range. He's got all types of Hall of Fame badges, man. And he's still selling right now for almost 600,000 MT in the auction house. And if Ruby would have been just a little bit faster, he would have been able to walk away with almost half a million MT profit. But instead, man, he ends up missing one of the best cards in the game, Diamond Steph Curry for 100K. And that right there is going to be the video, man. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed enjoyed it if you did make sure to smash that like button for me make sure to also sub to the channel man we're almost at 30,000 subscribers on youtube and as always guys thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video